You know, in real world, not all the data come into a native Pandas data frame like CSV or Excel. You might want, for instance, to extract the content of this PDF file and specifically collect those tables into a Pandas data frame. We have this one, this one, and that one. And one way of solving this issue is to use a library called tabulopi. Let me show you how it works. So to be able to use tabulopi, what you have to do first is to install the library using the pip um, uh, module uh, instruction. So what I do here is pip dash qqq install tabulopi. The qqq is to not make the output you know shown in the installation process because sometimes when you install a library it shows a bunch of information so I don't want those to be um, shown here so when I run I have I have the installation process going on so this is done so what I have to do next is to um, import um, the function that is going to make the reading process so from Tabula, I import read PDF. So read PDF is going to read the content of the PDF file I showed you here right now. So after that, what I have to do is to initiate a variable URL taking the content of the URL. This is exactly the PDF file I showed you here right now. Like we have cedo.org. And here is the full path of the URL. So this is the same, the same information I'm putting here. And right after that, what you have to do is to call this function. Now tabula data. This is the result I'll be getting. Read PDF. I get the URL, and I'm interested in getting all the pages. You know. So now I run this one. This might take a bit of time, you know, but sometimes depending on the speed of your internet, you know, and here is the result, tabular data. And in this tabular data, you can notice that it returns a list of tables. This is the first table, the second table here, which is, yeah, this is the first table, the second table, and the third one, which is here. So let's say we are only interested in this table. What we have to do is to get tabula. Since it is a list, we can get the second element of the list. And here it is. We get the table, the table, and the result is a pandas data frame. We can simply get the head of this, let's say six first element of a table. Of a data frame and then that's it so that's pretty much all you know it helps you easily extract the content of the tables within a pdf file so if you like this video give it a thumbs up and see you next time for a new video bye bye